So, for this problem, so iman cake the ball at a velocity of 12 meters per second, then with an angle 47.8 degrees, then the ball lands at the top of the tree after 5 seconds. So, if this is the ball kicked by the man, then with a velocity 12 meters per second in the angle is 47.8 degrees then the ball lands at the top of the tree then we need to find the height of the tree so how tall is the tree so this one is a vertical distance the dy and formula to solve for dy so we have dy component times the time plus one half times the gravity times the time squared so first we need to find the vertical component the viy so the initial velocity for y so this is equal to the velocity that's 12 then times sine the given angle 47.8 degrees so to solve now for the vertical component for the initial velocity so this is 12 then sine 47.8 so this is equal to 8.89 so this is 8.89 then meters per second so since we have now the y component for the initial velocity so we can solve now the vertical distance or the height of the tree so we have dy equals the initial for y that's 8.89 times the time and the time is 5 seconds then plus this one half is equal to 0 0.5 times the gravity this is constant negative 9.8 times the time squared so the time is 5 so this is 5 squared so we have now dy equals so this 8.89 times 5 to 8.89 times 5 this is 44.45 so 44.45 then plus so this 0 0.5 times 9.8 times 5 squared so we have 0 0.5 times negative 9.8 times 5 squared so that's equal to negative 122.5 so negative 122.5 then to find now dy equals so we have 44.45 then minus so this one is negative 122.5 so dy is negative 78.05 so this is negative 78.05 meters so therefore the height of the tree is 78.05 meters then for this problem so what is the horizontal distance so to find the horizontal distance this is the horizontal distance or the dx and formula this is equal to the initial velocity for x times the time so first we need to find the initial velocity for x so the initial 
velocity for x, this is equal to 12. Then cosine the given angle 47.8 degrees. So 47.8 degrees. So the initial velocity for x equals, so we have 12, then cosine 47.8. So, this is equal to 8.06. So, 8.06 meters per second. Then, to find now the horizontal distance, that's the dx equals. So, formula is the initial velocity for x times the time. Or, this is 8.06. And the time is 5. So, therefore, the horizontal distance equals, so 8.06 times 5, so that's 40.3. So, this is 40.3 meters.